complex sentence beginning with when part one. 今课嚟教用 when 开句嘅复合句子，就系话咧 when 咧之后咧有两个半句嘅，中间有个 comma。我哋详细睇下句型啦。Past continuous tense with when. We can use the past continuous tense. 就用个过去嘅进行式啦。Only in complete longer action, and the simple past tense for the completed shorter action. 你話長啲嗰個動作咧，我哋用個 past continuous tense； 而短啲嗰個咧，係一個嘅 simple past tense。我哋實際睇個例子啊。When I was talking to Grandma, was talking 係一個長啲嘅句子啊嘛。She told me that Uncle Tom used to be a street letter writer. 而 told 呢個動作咧，我就講一件事俾我聽，係一個嘅短啲嘅動作，而且係一個完成咗嘅。咁我哋睇到兩個分別咯。中間我有個 comma 噶。Past continuous tense with when and while. 大家仲記唔記得 past continuous tense 係點樣噶？ Past continuous tense 咧，裏邊一定有個 was 或者 were 喎，嗱，認住啦。之後咧就有個 base form， 呢個 base form 就有動詞原形啦。記住加翻 ing 喺尾啦。譬如 was reading 啦 ，were playing 啦。Now we use the past continuous tense to show that an action continues for a period of time in the past。我哋講一啲比較長啲嘅動作。啊！喺過嘅時間發生咗嘅一啲長啲嘅啊動作進行緊嘅。For example, we were watching TV from seven to nine o'clock last night。成段時間我哋做緊嘅嘢啦，就係、是、were watching TV。My baby sister was crying for two hours yesterday. Two hours 一個嘅比較長啲嘅時間啦。We were not enjoying the party last night。而家 not 即係擺喺中間嘅。嗱，咁因為講下 when 或者 while 啊，寫個長句子嘅話咧，我哋點用啦 ？We use the past continuous tense with when or while to describe longer background action。就話喺個。背景嗰個部分嘅比較長啲嘅動作裏邊咧，我哋記住咧就用個 past continuous tense 噶啦。When something else happened， 另一個動作咧再發生嘅時候咧係比較短啲，我用個 past tense 噶喎。好啦，我睇下例子。When you suddenly introduces the shorter action。就係、是、when 嗰部分咧個動作比較短啲㗎，咁但係過後用咩 tense？ 嗱睇句 ，I was shopping from three to five o'clock yesterday afternoon. I met Mike at three thirty p.m. 邊個動作係長啲啊？嗱當然就係 I was shopping 啦。而短嘅動作就係 I met Mike。好啦 ，I met Mike 嘅動作咧。就係、是、short action， 用咗係就係 simple past tense。呢個就係一個 short action 嚟㗎。Practice， 嗱我哋以下咧三句三句，大家填翻上個 tense， 大家可以停機睇清楚做一個題目，先至再睇落去㗎。大家寫個答案未咧 ？Number one， she was reading。When she heard the car crash, number two, when the dog jumped up at the boy, he was walking across the street. Number three, I was waiting. 
for the bus when the old man fell over. 边一度再长啲啊？啊，大家睇到清楚啦，就系、是、was waiting 啦。有冇啱晒咧？我哋睇另外三条啊。Number four to number six， 大家如果停机做咗，再睇下啱唔啱咯。大家最好里面咧，我哋睇 number four。Peter was going home。佢當時係翻緊屋企途中啦。When a bottle hits him on the head， 比較短啲動作咧就係跌落嚟撞到佢嗰下啦。Hit。Number five, number six， 同時兩個動作咧發生喺個廚房度嘅。When Kitty cut her finger， she was cooking。比較長啲動作咧就係 was cooking 啦。We were watching TV. Number six. We were watching TV. When we smelled. Now your smell 真系不规则动词啦。你个加 t 记未噶？啊 ，number seven and eight， 仲有两条啦，但系又停机写低再做落去啦。大家做好未咧 ？Number seven. They were swimming when the man cried it for help. Number eight. Tim was coming out of the cinema when the accident happened. 邊個動作係長啲啊？就係、是、was coming out， 而短啲動作咧就係、是、happened。大家有冇做啱曬咧 ？Now remember that we can put while and when at the beginning or in the middle of a sentence。喺句嘅句頭同埋中間都可以係擺個 while 或者 when 呢個位置嘅喎。If we put them in the middle of the sentence。如果 when 擺喺中間嘅話咧 ，we do not need to use a comma to separate the two clauses。我哋係冇 comma 嘅喎。嗱 ，for example， the other spray us with water while we were not looking。第二句就 the other spray us with water while we were looking。第三句 while we were not looking， the other spray us with water。呢度邊句係啱啊？大家聽記住，聽清楚。啊，當然第一句咧，依、这個 comma 多餘咗啦，我哋唔接受噶。第二句咧用咗 while 喎 ，while 係啱噶。第三句咧 ，while 用一句頭咧，我哋咧就又加個 comma 落去嘅喎。咁依句啱唔啱啊？依句係啱嘅。我哋睇下啲句型可以點改寫咧。嗱 ，rearrange the following statement by putting when or while in the middle of a sentence。係啊，兩個句型咧，都想大家練下。所以 number one 咧，大家可以停機嚟揾張紙寫低。大家寫好未咧？如果你將個 while 擺喺句中嘅時候，我哋可以咁寫噶。She blew the audience a kiss while she was walking down the red carpet. 大家 while 用嘅位置，記住唔加 comma 喎、哦。好 ，number two。When he was sleeping, he fell from his bed。將位擺中間嘅時候點用啊 ？He fell from his bed when he was sleeping。你 when 擺中間嘅時候咧，嗰、那個地方咧就成句都冇 comma 噶。嗱，跟住我哋又試下填呢啲 tense， 大家會搞清個 past tense 同 past continuous tense 係擺邊個位置啦。嗱，大家可以停機睇清楚。大家聽清楚未咧？嗱，大家寫啲答案咯喎。好，我而家對下答案啦。大家頭兩條做得啱唔啱咧？我哋睇下 was trying、was writing 都係兩個長嘅動作嚟噶。而 number two，while I was watching the fashion program，my dad was reading a newspaper， 
係講兩個同步進行動作嘅，係之前教 Y 嘅句型咧，大家都有印象學過噶。Number three， 大家用得啱唔啱咧？嗱 ，Y 嘅部分咧係長啲嘅動作嚟嘅喎。下半句 He fell asleep 係比較短啲嘅動作嚟嘅。Number four，A thief stole my bag 係短啲嘅動作。While I was shopping last Sunday， 比較長啲動作咧，就係 was shopping 啦。Number five，my grandma hurt her finger， 整傷嘅手係一下子嘅啫。When she was shopping， 當時做緊動作長啲嘅咧，就喺度切緊菜噶。Number six，her boss saw her when she was sleeping in front of the computer， 瞓嘅當然係長啲時間啦，俾人眼望到咧就係 saw 比較短啲動作啦。大家有冇做啱曬咧？ Now do the exercise to test yourself. Bye.